and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an I It is our understanding that they've gone with a 4-5-1. Well, most teams that use this system, Peter, will work it in a, a way where Yes, they'll have a 4-5-1 shape off the ball and ideally a 4-3-3 shape on it. We often see that 4-1-4-1 shape too and that has an obvious flexibility about it. It's a, it's a popular managerial selection because of that. It's just extremely flexible with all the numbers I've mentioned. That gets things running. Well, that's where he wants it. Aurier. A really good feat from him. Kessier. Oh, shooting chance! They've scored! And what a start! The keeper deserves some sympathy there. He may not have seen that until too late. Ivory Coast take the early advantage. Diaby. Traore. Kessier. Pepe. Driving on, he could shoot here. Pepe! Knocks it away. Tries to get it forward quickly. Let down by a lack of accuracy. Aurier plays it forward. And here's Sahar. Kessier, a scorer already in the game. Kone, Ivory Coast are seeing a lot of the ball and have a 1-0 lead to show for it. Marega. And helps available out wide. There are a few waiting for it. Traub calling for him to shoot. And that's a throw. Chayore, foot in. Well, they're looking at the referee, but he's waved play on. Aurier. Zaha. There has been just the early goal here, and the score is 1 0. Chayore. Haitara. It's a busy front line, uh, lots of movement. And is that working for you? Well, not really. To be honest, I, I'm not a great fan of taking goal potential away from the penalty box. Timely intervention. Diaby. And it's Traore. Kone. Traore. Kone. Oh, nice touch. And that is going out for a goal kick. Yeah. 
hoists it forward. It's come loose. Marega, and the counter is on. Haidara. Ivory Coast are leading with half-time drawing close. Mali have a free kick. Well, he can't say now that he hasn't been warned. Yeah, and he's just entered the last chance saloon. One wrong move now, and he's in trouble. Koulibaly gets into a dangerous position. He's left his man. Zaha. Zaha. And shoots! Oh, that is rather wayward. Well, that's why we all say indecision is fatal. Did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Three for me. Ivory Coast leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments, and it's 1-0 at the break. So we're just settling back into this second half. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Traore. Haitara. Diaby. Haitara. Into the box. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those breaking passes just to spread the play. to the left Chiore Gineppo <laughs> yeah it looks like a, a change of approach and it may just freshen things up There was to be only one outcome. Yeah, he just calmly faced the keeper and waited. It became a, a who blinks first situation. And for me, there was never any doubt as to who was going to come out on top. Two goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, with this kind of authority, Peter, why not push on and, and totally kill this off? And it is over the line. <laughs> Pepe. Looking to hit the front line. Mariga provides an outlet. Oh, that's neat. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Goes for goal! They've done it! Back to within one. Interesting. Oh, high-quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second.
Mali get themselves back into contention. I think they can sense a comeback here, and so can this crowd. It's all systems go now. Look at the way that back line is, is coming under serious pressure. High pressing that's being applied with real pace too. Quite, you got it. Yeah, it's pretty sapping, especially at this stage, Peter, but they need to be quick with the press here. Sacco. Picks one in. Cleared without complication. And it's been taken straight back. Seri. That's a decent ball. Has a hit! It's in! Two ahead, late in the day. Game over, surely. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. And they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. their change now with uh, a break in play. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Ivory Coast, two up and into a position of real strength. Haitara. Traore. That's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. Yeah, and the creator-in-chief is unsurprisingly being treated as a special... Real chance! Yes! And surely that settles it! Ivory Coast are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Ivory Coast blast themselves into a three-goal lead. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt will be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Haitara. Traore. Haitara. He's not played the ball, that's a foul. Well, the ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Triori. Forward it goes. Triori. Time added on four minutes. And he certainly caught him there. It's a free kick.
and it's Saha. Sako. Vage. Haitara. And in time is up. And there goes the whistle. Ivory Coast, winners of a no contest. They just swamped their opponents in superior quality. What are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? Ivory Coast.